Radiohead have performed their much-anticipated gig in Israel, after calls from protesters to cancel the show. Radiohead are wrong to play in Israel. Here's why. Dave Randall read more the sold-out concert went ahead as planned at Yarkon Park in Tel Aviv on Wednesday, despite urgings from activists and campaigners who have said the show is an insult to Palestinian people facing oppression in the country. According to Richard Ferrer, editor of the London-based Jewish News newspaper, the audience of thousands represented melting pot of fans. He tweeted a picture of the stage and quoted Radiohead frontman Tom York telling the crow, a lot was said about this. But in the end we played some music. According to reports, Radiohead played a 27-song set and two encores, including hits such as No Surprises, Creep and Karma Police. Richard Ferrer, at Rich Ferrer, true melting pot crowded at Radiohead concert in Apartheid, hashtag Israel Tonight exposes a pack by at boycott his relic for what they really are, pick Twitter. Com, Ike Impso July 19, 2017 It comes a week after York defended the band's decision to play in the country, following criticism by award-winning British filmmaker, Ken Loach. Loach wrote to the singer on Twitter that, Radiohead, need to decide if they stand with the oppressed or the oppressor.